Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are in the world. My name is Miss Halima. I am the dance teacher, dance instructor here at Elmhurst. This is my first year here, and I can tell you it has been a wonderful journey. We've danced, we've talked, we've shared, we've learned, and we continue to stand in our power. Now, in this phase of dance where the school year is winding down, um, our dance students have been able to learn the different aspects of movement through cultural dance, modern dance, and all styles of dance, as well as the history of where those dances come from, the language, the foods, and the mental, spiritual, and physical nutrition that we need in order to move our bodies. So today's project, or the project itself, is focusing on our students reflecting on these moments of learning how to move their bodies, how to continue to stand in our power, and how to really internalize dance on a different level. So they will be sharing their thoughts, ideas, and maybe teaching us a little bit about what they learned this year in dance. Stay tuned. about 8.20 in the morning here on a Tuesday, May 2nd. And um, just got in the studio trying to get the class ready for the day. Uh, there's a lot going on. We're at the end stretch of our year. Um, they're getting ready for their fifth, fifth assessment uh, for the year. This will be their last assessment where I um, evaluate their knowledge of um, history and culture, nutrition, uh, through a quiz, a written quiz, as well as through um, physical movement, uh, where all the dances we have been um, studying for the whole year, um, they have to demonstrate that. Um, each class is a little different. Um, so I'm just really excited to see what the students are bringing to the table. If the information that I have taught them, if they have internalized it and um, will express that for this last assessment. You know, um, I am actually getting ready to do a mediation with one student. This is my second mediation this year. So I want to share that to let you know that all is not perfect. You know, there's issues that happen throughout the year um, where mediations are very essential to um, restoring um, student-teacher relationships when things are misunderstood, things happen, things are said. And, you know, the goal is to repair it, right? So um, I am interested to do this mediation and hope that we can come to a, a mutual agreement on the respect level that needs to happen in this class and understand the student's perspective as well because they all have a voice. And yeah, so I just wanted to chime in here and stay tuned.